Hi, I'm Gary Kiltz. I'm the superintendent of Greendale Schools. Greendale Schools is one of the premier school districts in the state of Wisconsin. We typically are in the top 10% of academic achievement in the state. I'd like to talk to you about some of the work we're looking at doing related to facilities improvement. In 2016, we started the process of going through a strategic visioning and developing our strategic priorities. We've called them Vision 2020. As part of this planning process, we had our priority teams take a look at those priorities and match them with the types of learning environments that we wanted students to be in in order to continue to grow, achieve at high levels, and enjoy their learning experiences. As a result of that, we've identified four key drivers or priorities around our facilities moving forward. One of those is around safety and security. Another one is around learning environments. The third one is around flexible, adaptable classrooms. And the final one is around efficient systems in our buildings. Our goal with the facility improvement work is to create safe environments for our staff, students, and community members. This begins with making sure that as students and parents are entering and leaving our buildings, that the walkways coming into the building and out of the building are safe. We also want to make sure that once in the building, students and staff are safe from dangers outside the school. This requires investments in secure entrances, security doors, and cameras. As our teaching and learning methods evolve to include more collaborative and experiential activities for our students, the learning environments including classrooms, libraries, and multi-purpose rooms also require changes. For example, library spaces become more collaborative and more innovative commons for our students where they have the opportunity to work together, experiment, and create their projects using video or 3D technology. Fine arts and technology education classrooms are designed for project-based learning through an interdisciplinary approach that reinforces critical thinking, exploration, and creation practices. Additional classroom space is also needed to help maintain reasonable classroom sizes, provide dedicated space to arts, music, and world language, and help grow our early learning program, Time for Learning. As the nature of schooling and community use changes over time, it's important to position Greendale schools to be flexible and adaptable to these changing conditions. The need for larger group space with additions to multi-purpose rooms at the elementary becomes important. These multi-purpose rooms also serve to create a more effective and efficient flow of work for students and staff throughout the school day. Gym space can be dedicated for its intended purpose while well, the multi-purpose room serves multiple functions including as a cafeteria during lunch. The function and purpose of library space also becomes more flexible and adaptable. One way that Greendale schools can save substantial money is by changing out older mechanical units for more efficient, lower energy units. By changing out heating and adding in air conditioning units, we are able to improve the overall air quality in our schools while having a short timeline to receive a return on the investment through energy savings and cost reductions. Investment in LED lighting and occupancy sensors also allow ways to reduce costs while improving learning conditions for our students. The purpose is to improve the learning conditions for students, staff, and community members who are using the facilities on a regular basis while also reducing costs long-term through more efficient systems.